Brendan Docks is the busiest dock area of all the island of Sodor. It's where ships, cranes and engines are like busy day and night, every day of the year. But today was different. Lots of ships are coming into the port with huge loads of cargo. Cranky, as well as another crane, Mickey, are, are working very hard. But unfortunately, Cranky is always cranky, and he's getting tired of it by the minute. Uh, gotta get this load unloaded. Whoa, Cranky, wait, you forgot, there's a truck that was supposed to be underneath you. Oh, dear. Oh, I forgot about that. Don't worry, Cranky. I came to the rescue. Here you go. <sighs> Thanks, Salty. I can't believe it. A lot of these ships are coming in. This must be the busiest one I have ever seen. You're quite right there, Cranky. With all this work, we won't even get enough sleep. I guess we'll have to work all night long. It's a good thing you are here to help out, Timothy. Are you always willing to help, Salty? While Salty was chatting with Timothy, Cranky was ready to unload a second shipment of pipes. Unfortunately, Salty was so distracted that he reversed back too slowly, and the first shipment of pipes hit the second shipment, causing the pipes to spill all over the tracks. Unfortunately, some hit Salty, and they pushed Salty off the rails, onto the quay, and pushed him into the ocean. Oh no! Help me! Captain is over. Don't worry, Salty. I got you. Thanks, Cranky. I thought I would be in the Davy Jones locker by now. Oh, Salty, are you all right? Oh, dear. This dock area is now a mess. Hello, I came here to collect the... Oh, never mind. Derek rushed to take Salty to the diesel works. Hello, Salty. How, um, um, what I mean is... What he means is, how are you? Broken down? Uh, not exactly, you two. I nearly fell into the sea. <gasps> Don't worry, Cranky's rescue me. I'll be fine. Just get me repaired quickly as possible that I can get back to the docks. The docks area are getting crazier by the minute. Hello, Timothy. You're tired, are you? Uh, I am, Edward. Since Salty is away, now there's a, too much for the two of us. And to add it all, I had to bring Bill and Ben over to help. Yes, exactly. We're here to help. We'll get this dock area cleaned up. It's much more worse than the last time we came here. This I got a feeling that I hope nothing will be bad happen, said Wood, but he spoke too soon. Big Mickey was transporting the cargo from the ships to Porter's trucks. As he's ready for the last batch, Porter reversed backwards a bit too far, and the cargo dropped onto Porter. Ouch! Oops. Sorry, Porter. But there was worse to come. Baxton! Look out! Oh no, that cannot be good. Oh! Ouch! What's that noise? Oh no! Now all the electrical systems in the diesel works are shut down. Thanks a lot, Paxson. Sorry. The fat controller arrived at Brendan Docks to check on how Porter and Timothy were. But he was horrified to see that Timothy and Porter were in their shed. What happened to both of you? He asked. I was hit in the funnel by a large piece of cargo, and unfortunately, it's now broken, and I can't even work. And I'm too tired. My wheels ache. And when I try to get moving, they're completely stiff. Oh dear, that cannot be good. This is the worst moment now. A lot of ships are coming in. Three times more than last year. Oh dear. Um, hello sir. I came here to collect- Oh, Nigel, there you are. Can you help out at the docks? Sure. 
But I nah. Thanks, Nigel. I got the dash. Hello, Thomas. Hello, Edward. I gotta tell you something. You had to report to the yards at Natford. The fat controller got some news for you as well as the other steam engines. What about the diesels? There's no time to explain everything. You got to go there now. All right then, Edward. I'll see you later. When Thomas arrived at the yards, almost all the engines were gathered. The fat controller made an announcement. All right, engines. You might be wondering why I call you all here. Okay, as you all know, most of you do not know what happened, is that the diesel works has suddenly had um, a blackout, and unfortunately, most of the diesels, almost all of them, are stuck. And unfortunately, we're lacking of all diesel engines. But what about some? Like Mavis, Daisy, those ones. Well, about that, most of them have already taken on bad fuel and they can't work until they're mended. So as a result, all of you steam engines had to do your own work as well as the diesels one. Oh, the indignity. Does that mean I had to pull freight as well as passengers at the same time? Not exactly. In fact, I got plenty of steam engines around on this island. You all match very well. Oh, I see, sir. Good. Now, almost all of you, you gotta do your own work as well as the diesels. As for you, Percy, I need you to head over to the docks to help out. Of course, sir. Now, everyone, dismiss. Yes, sir. Oh, and also, do not try to overwork yourself. You might want to cause some tiredness and confusion and delay. Got it? Got it, sir. Oh my goodness, there's so much to do. Come on, guys. We can do this. We can't let the railway down. You're right. Let's go.